Well, tonight I put together the heater in the shop. There'll be a full video on this, which I uh, got to use the ferro crimp set again. Pretty cool. Got a 15 amp power supply. Should do the trick. Uh, we'll give this a test drive tonight. Okay, that's crude for tonight, but that is my new diesel heater running in the shop instead of that monster that fills things full of stink and smoke. This is completely sealed. All the exhaust goes outside. Only air in, air out, heat exchanger on the inside. Nice and safe and uh, super. It kicks a lot of heat. That's pretty cool. I like it. That's what the uh, makerspace is looking like. It is only three degrees Celsius in here tonight. And that's actually warming up a little bit. It is cold. They're cool. It's gonna get worse, but now we can work in here this winter. day in the shop today working with the laser getting the wife's Christmas presents done I'm actually really happy with these so I've got different key tags uh, with their company website on them pens uh, I forget what else and I put them in a cool uh, wooden box that I've actually just got carrying over here um, yeah it's still wet <laughs> taken weeks to dry because this room wasn't heated but now it is that diesel heater is doing a good job quite pleased with things check this out fresh off the press I like it not too shabby I can live with those diesel heater's been here in three days now and I have it on the lowest setting it's just sipping away on almost no diesel. It's got it up to 10 C in here. That may not seem like much, but it's a heck of a lot warmer than the ambient. I actually haven't had this room up to temp in weeks, so I'm thinking it won't have a hard time keeping things warm once I bring everything up. So I'm just gonna let this run this weekend and just see. I know how much diesel it'll use. Uh, it's easy to do the math and uh, it's not cheap. It's uh, two dollars and some, uh, right around two dollars a liter for farm diesel right now. But uh, for a warm shop over the Christmas break that I can actually work in and do things, I like it. Well, hit the old Walmarts today. Uh, crazy busy with the holidays, but I needed a laminator. And these they have for 30 bucks. And well, I have lots and lots of laminated plastic, but what I need, uh, I wanted to laminate these uh, tap and drill clearance sizes and cross-reference sheets for machining in the garage. I'm always having to look them up on my phone and it's getting my phone all goobery. So it's time to post them. I don't use them that often, but uh, it's good to have them on the wall somewhere. And paper doesn't live well in the garage, so I'm going to give this thing a try. Shigun. Lovely. They did a fine job. Nothing wrong with that. Okie dokie. These will do just exactly what I need them to do. This one will do double sided because it's more or less 
duplicating the other two with a couple other handy things on here. The pipe thread sizes. Uh, that I don't need very often, but sometimes. Not too shabby. Huh, what do you know? For 30 bucks, I'm good with that. The sleeves are ridiculous expensive from Scotch, but yeah, onward and upward.